Right then, here we go. We've now got the D810 on it. I did have to slide it a bit further forward to counterbalance the weight of the D810 on the battery, battery grip, but we're still, oops, it's still quite usable. It's reasonably stable. Like the other one, if I wanted to, I can, you know, I can, oops, with a bit of effort, I can rock it, but if you just want to flip the lens cap on, pop the lens cap off, shove it in my view. It's it's burning fine, even to the sides. I mean, I'm giving that quite a reasonable thump, and it's not falling over. Same on the back edge. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, if you were using it. Probably be shooting with your on your, your left hand on the plate anyway, just to make sure. Stick that on top of a fence post or, or a wall, and you're going to be reasonably stable. I'm certainly surprised how stable that is with a 70 to 200 on there. That's it's extended up to 200. Not as if it goes anywhere when you go to 70, but the weight inside changes, but it's still okay, still fine. Yeah. What more could you ask for? Uh, anything else you want, just let me know. Thanks.